So, what did you find? Can we really trust Dima? Or is he hiding something? I found Dima's earliest memories. He murdered and replaced someone in Far Harbor. Then he covered it up. Even hiding the knowledge of it from himself. Damn it. I was hoping I was wrong. But I just knew there was something. Do you know why he did it? I think he just wants peace for everyone on the island. Even if it means controlling them from the shadows. So, he means the best? Should we... help him? Is Acadia worth saving? There's good people... synths... here. I need to think this through, Kasumi. Yeah. We both do. Thank you for telling me the truth, at least. Whatever you decide, just keep in mind that there are innocent lives here. No matter what Dima has done. I hope you don't mind, but I had Chase so, shadow Dima. you. Look, she saw you Joby entering and leaving the nucleus. I didn't and want to Faraday believe you at first me about that our been being some brothers. Theft from his office, a certain computer program he and I had been working on. So, you know about my memories. I can only ask you to return whatever you found to me. They are mine, after all. I have a memory of yours about a nuclear launch key. You knew how to detonate the sub and the nucleus all along. Give me a m Remember for myself. So... I chose to forget the launch key even existed. Poor Confessor Martin. Was I lying to him all that time? The submarine is rusted into the dry dock. The only target that missile is ever going to hit is the base itself. The nucleus. Where the children of Adam live. We have to keep that key out of the wrong hands. The nucleus has innocent people living there among the zealots threatening Far Harbor. I found the launch key already. I'll make sure it's never used. Thank you. Was there anything else in my memories? Some way we can work towards peace? One of your memories was about a kill switch you installed to shut down power to Far Harbor and let the fog take them. It's all here in this holotape. 
Let me see this. I remember. I was afraid that Far Harbor might turn against us. See us as too different for their precious island. So I made a contingency plan. Mass murder. Code because I couldn't stomach the thought of actually using it. Then I hid the memory because I couldn't even stand knowing I made it. What have I done? If the children of Adam were to ever get a hold of that code, they would destroy Far Harbor. Don't worry, Dima. I already have the code. Far Harbor is safe. Good. Now we just need to find some way to end this conflict. Have you found anything else in my memories? Your memories led me to a gravesite. You killed Captain Avery and replaced her with a synth. So you could control Far Harbor. What? That's impossible. Let me see what you found. I... I did it. I killed a woman from Far Harbor and replaced her. I stripped a synth's identity from her and made her an agent. Okay. Let's... Be practical. How do we proceed from here? You're right. We have to focus on what has to be done now. Just because I sure don't. I'm starting to see things more clearly. We have to keep this secret from Far Harbor. If they knew I had done this, they wouldn't destroy just me. They'd come after Acadia, and then without us. The fog condensers will eventually fall into disrepair. Everyone will die. I... have an idea. There's still a way we can bring peace. But the fact that I've replaced a human with a synth must remain hidden. So... You did all of that on your own. No one else in Acadia is involved. What I've done goes against all of our ideals. I even hid it from myself. So, no, there can't be anyone else. <sighs> I'll keep your secret, Dima. Thank you. Maybe the... Guilt will keep me focused. That didn't seem to stop him before. As horrifying as it might be to suggest, this memory you've recovered has given us a new option. If Far Harbor could be made more tranquil, by, then perhaps the same trick will work twice on the children of Atom. We could replace High Confessor Tectus with someone willing to forgive Far Harbor and work towards reconciling. All right, tell me what your plan is. This will be difficult for both of us, but I think it's our only option. I'll need you to leverage your access to the High Confessor and lure him to a secluded location. You should be able to find a spot in the Bay's old command center where you can deal with him discreetly and hide the remains. Once your work is done, return here and the replacement will move in and take command. I know this... this is a lot to take in. Do we have to kill the High Confessor? It would be the most reliable way of dealing with him. 
but any method that removes Tectus from power indefinitely should work. Okay, I'll do it. Any ideas? Tectus lives in fear of being usurped by his predecessor, Martin. Despite that, in all likelihood, Martin is dead. But if you somehow uncovered evidence of Martin's imminent return, I expect Tectus would be interested hearing all you know in private. All we have to do is manufacture Martin's uprising. To do so, I'll need raw material. Martin recorded many of our conversations. Those in the nucleus have certainly been destroyed, but I built a small refuge for Martin many years ago when he needed respite from the family. Go there and collect any tapes you can find. I'll begin work on our replacement. And here, I want you to have this as well. What you've done for us.